Well, hello, this is Candy, your certified Christian life coach with the heart of a minister. And welcome to Order Your Steps. Last week, I promised you that I would share my Holy Ghost intervention, which I had after my marriage endured a major hurdle. And I was also hoping to have my husband to join me so that he could share his perspective on how our lives and marriage has changed so much since that time. But I must continue to allow the Holy Spirit to lead us on this spiritual journey. So instead, this week's episode is entitled, From Red Flags to Breakthroughs, Your Exodus Journey. But first, I want to ask if you were able to complete the journal task prompting the the journal prompting that I tasked you all with last week where I asked you to define the characteristics of a great relationship. And I also said to identify three red flags, which would be relationship challenges and three green flags, which would be relationship strengths. And I believe that as you made those journal entries that the Holy Spirit, if you were listening, would have prepared you for this week's episode and your Exodus journey. So for context, you must go back to Exodus 14 when the children of Israel had crossed the Red Sea after leaving Egypt after many, many years of bondage. We have spent a lot of time in bondage in Egypt The Lord has heard our cry. He wants to free us, but we have become rather comfortable and rather accustomed to our surroundings. The Holy Spirit has sent us red flags to let us know that it's time for a change, but we've ignored them because we're not quite sure that we want the Lord to change those things that he needs to change according to his plan. But the Holy Spirit had to remind us that we're not leaving this place of comfort empty-handed. We're leaving with so many riches. We're leaving with wisdom and growth based on our experience. We're leaving with good times and maybe not so good times. We're leaving with grace and gold and silver and all the many blessings that the Lord has blessed us with while we were in Egypt. Then we miraculously crossed the Red Sea on dry land and the Lord drowned our enemies. He wanted to free us from anything and everything that was standing in the way of us accomplishing our purpose. After such a long journey, the Lord knew that we were still a little too weak to go through Philistine country. We didn't have the strength to fight the giants that were ahead. So instead, he sent us to the wilderness so that we could spend some time with him resting in his presence to, in order to replenish, restore, and be strengthened for the next leg of our journey. But we were in the wilderness a lot longer than we'd anticipated. But we were strengthened while we were there. We would now have to cross the raging waters of the Jordan Life would continue to life. Life would continue to be lifing. And we still had giants to fight. The Lord has positioned us for the battle. But in order to occupy the land, our next is going to take a lot more. 
Unfortunately, many of us believe that we're all ready giving the Lord our all. But he wants us to understand. He wants our all. With the help of the Holy Spirit, we are being positioned for a spiritual breakthrough. A sudden, dramatic, and important development or discovery in our lives which begins when we decide to trust the Lord to do the supernatural and the impossible in our lives. Now once we've achieved this breakthrough, then we'll be ready for our promotion to be elevated to the next level. Now for some of us, the Holy Spirit has been sending these red flags to tell us that there are relationships that we need to let go of because they are standing in the way or holding us back from giving God our very best. The Holy Spirit was trying to prepare us for a change, but again, we chose to ignore him. For some of us, it was because of fear, fear of the unknown. We didn't have the courage to leave the familiar and the comfortable, to go into uncharted territory. But only you know what you need for your next. It may be a therapist, a coach. It may be a time of self-care, maybe even a new relationship a new career, or you just might need a Holy Ghost intervention. Whatever it is, it is going to require a lot more than we've been giving. For we are God's masterpiece. He has created us anew in Christ Jesus so that we can do the good things he planned for us long ago. Well, I hope that this Holy Ghost download has blessed you and I've given you a little inspiration and encouragement because you will need it if you are going to live a life guided by the Holy Spirit this week and the weeks to come. Now, as a certified Christian life coach with the heart of a minister, I blend my Christian values with your typical basic coaching techniques. But I want to nurture and uplift primarily women in their personal and spiritual journeys. And as I mentioned last week, I'm hosting a women's retreat entitled Journey to a Spiritual Breakthrough. Now, some of you, the Holy Spirit is already prompting you to be in the room. So the link will be in the podcast description. So get your tickets today. Now, we would love for you to leave us a comment or two about this week's episode. And please share with a friend. Subscribe now to Order Your Steps, Aligning Your Space mind, soul, and spirit. Don't forget to check us out on Instagram at Order Your Steps for snippets of encouragement throughout the week. Remember, the Lord directs the steps of the godly. He delights in every detail of our lives. And although we may stumble, we will never fall because the Lord is holding our hand. See you next week. Bye-bye for now.